led by Nabil Ben Salah, his fifth USL Championship assignment of the year already. He actually did have Miami FC and San Antonio last week. Absolutely, and I really like this addition. Stable Ortaka provides lethal speed out wide. Sajanovic going forward, and they're both good goal scorers. Goodrum scored 22 goals in 2022. The ninth overall meeting between Birmingham Legion and FC Tulsa starts now. Stefano Pino and Birmingham Legion get things underway tonight. And this cross is much more effectively tonight than if they were inverted. Two hands in the air for Pasher. Served to the back post. Creek punched it away. And as far as Kobe Hernandez Foster, who looped it back in. Kavita got back on side. His shot was on frame. Save the rebound over the top from Tabor Itaka. A long look at this one. And Ferry again. It's Portillo's serve. Headed away by Patterson. It falls for Goodrum. Goodrum's shot is in. Philip Goodrum back in the starting 11 and back on the score sheet. FC Tulsa have the opening goal. Tulsa back on the ball here. Segrist a little bit of space. Finds the goal score. Goodrum again, edge the area. Lays it off. First time shot, Van Okel holds. Not a bad effort there from Ferry. Good job by Segrist to get to that first. Couldn't quite get it back from Diallo though. Here comes Prosper Kasim in the Legion. Tyler Pasher, acres of space on this right side. Some defending to do for Swahi. Pasher still on the move. Pasher, a kick save and a beauty by Creek. He had that near post covered. Make sure you got your gear ready for the next home match here at Protective Stadium. Good serve by Pasher, headed on frame just a little bit too tall. One or two step approach, similar to the ball he played in. Just pick his spot and, and go for that top corner. It is Portillo and Van Okel makes a two-handed save. There, he can't, he's not going to go down the line and serve a ball. He is going to cut inside. McCartney wants to serve it. Pino got a head to it off the post. I love that from McCartney. Martinez couldn't quite bring it under control. Segrist clears it, and that's the final action of this first half. Cam Legion dangerous early and dangerous late. If you win the ball in an unexpected manner, if you can play that first ball forward and break one or two lines of defense with it, you are going to create a lot more opportunities for yourself. Van Okel had to scurry back. That's a little bit of space to work with here. Pino trying to turn, found Pasher. Pasher pulled it wide. He's saying. There was a touch there after he got that shot off, but Faree didn't buy it. What Nobody a, in the middle of the park for Legion FC right now. What a ball from Ferry. Here comes Tulsa. It's four on four as Lotso gets forward. Diallo leaves it off. Segrist serves. Van Okel saves. And this is getting end to end. Here comes Kasim back the other direction, working with Pasher. And this end to end. And if you're... Your coach Sanchez, what you're telling your guys right now is keep doing what you're doing. You're starting to find the spaces in the middle of the field uh, and create for yourself. Rogers and behind the defense, serves it across. It's an easy tap-in goal. Stoyanovic doubles the FC Tulsa advantage. And there's Rogers. We talked about him uh, with Coach Sanchez earlier this week, a guy who's really impressed him. He's a USL one defender of the year last year. Comes in, puts in good service. We talked about if he continues to get the opportunity to do that, he will create a goal for his team, and he does just that. Uh, it's a simple tap in. It's McCartney offering a short option. Martinez to the back post. Pino heads it down, redirected once it's off the bar. Cavita's header blocked. Pino again saved. That was absolute chaos. Stefan Stojanovic. Tulsa see out this three-point performance tonight, or does Birmingham have something left in the tank here over the next 19-plus minutes? A couple of touches here for the newest sub, uh, Marana, who connects with Nwankpo. Pasher. That's a fantastic Nwankbo. ball. What a ball. Nwankbo centers it. Martinez scores. There you go. That's what you need to do if you're Legion FC. 
What a fantastic ball from Tyler Pasher to unlock Nwegbo. And then Nwegbo has the calm, cool, and collected composure to lay a simple pass back for Martinez to walk on to to finish, to bring this game to 2-1. We talked about the next goal was going to be the most important and of paramount importance for this match. Now we have a real game on our hands. 2-1 instead of 3-0. Now you've got 15, 20 minutes left to go and find a second if you're Legion FC. If you're Tulsa, they just had a little huddle on the field off camera. They're looking to kind of regroup, reorganize themselves. You have to weather the storm. Checo working with Delu. Delu sends it to the other side of the park. Callaway, good body positioning there for the 17-year-old. Pino, was he bumped from behind? Yes. Free kick conceded by Bourgeois, who immediately sprints back. The Wegbo's open on the far side if you can get the ball out wide to him. Here it is. Pasture does find Nwagbo racing forward again. Nwagbo fires and it's into the side netting. It'll be a Birmingham corner. It'll be Pasture again to serve from that flag. Flat, driven, plenty of bend on it. Just like that. Back post, it's in! It's Pino and Birmingham have an equalizer in second half stoppage time. That's a fantastic ball from Pasture. That's exactly what you want. You know, Creek tried to come out and claim that ball. There's a lot of bodies in there. It's tough to come and collect something like that. But again, what a response from Legion FC after going down two. Didn't catch that cleanly. And it's on for Pasture, who finds Nwagbo in space. Here comes Nwagbo again. Diva Nwagbo shot just a little bit wide. The substitution and the goal. Segrist, Pacheco on the turn. Pacheco dispossessed. Roof clears it away. Pino chests it down. Pasher trying to get it back out to Martinez. Swahi was there first. Nwagbo there. collects. Referee is going to let the Legion go. Here comes Martinez. Martinez, Nuegbo, Nuegbo, a shot, punched away by Creek, another huge stop. Pasher serves to the back post again, and Marana couldn't quite redirect it on frame. That is full time, the points shared after a wild first half here in Birmingham.